Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Marvel Legends Netflix series, Elektra. Alright, so here's Electra out of the packaging, and my overall thought of this figure is I'm impressed. Um, I'm more impressed with this figure than I am the Jessica Jones. Um, <clears throat> everything came out great. The head sculpt, the hair, uh, all the paint apps are great. The red in her undershirt is awesome. Uh, the, my only gripe would have to be those forearms. She looks like she's Popeye. She's been eating too much spinach. <laughs> so I, I'm really happy with this figure. Uh, the articulation is great, everything like that. Um, ab crunch is pretty decent she go forward that much and back that much so I think it's really good legs kick out that much could have gone out a little more double jointed knees ankle pivot you know, just good articulation it would be awesome if the females started having double jointed elbows but that's for the future but very happy with this figure so taking a look at this head sculpt, uh, I still really like it even with the scarf on. Uh, her eyes are very enticing and the hair looks really good, the bangs, and the way that it comes out in the back right there is really cool, like it's windy. Uh, I really like the flaps and the mask and everything, make it look like it's real cloth. So they did a great job with this face. Alright, and here's the face off version, or the mask off version. Um, I really like it. Um, they captured the likeness of her really, really well. Um, the slender face and everything like that. The eyes came out great. The hair. Everything. Really impressed by this figure. She's really easy to pose around. So I've been able to get her in a couple poses I wanted to try out and they came out great. So I'm very happy with this Electra figure. Alright, and that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed the review. Uh, please hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and stay tuned for some other reviews.